Hey guys, welcome to the top 10 free scripts for July 2017. Number one is the Evolutive Dungeon Generator Lite, which will generate dungeons based on the size and complexity that you specify, and it will generate the um, actual size and and you can set maximum and minimum difficulties of the dungeon to create different sort of sections and layouts. And number two is the 2D Arena Minimap. And this just comes with basic scripts and prefabs for, the, for you to set up a 2D minimap in a game with sprites. It uses a simple render texture and it lets you view things like allies, enemies and things like that. Number three is advanced object pool and which will help you manage um, object pooling for things like uh, when you spawn a lot of objects and you destroy them within your game. It can help you recycle a lot of objects which can save a lot on performance if you're um, instantiating and spawning um, a lot of objects and then destroying them over time. So check this out if you're looking to optimize a little bit in that regard. And number four is the Q Singleton Graceful Singleton pattern and it just helps you create a singleton based on the singleton is just something where it only usually exists once and it will help you create something which is persistent across many different scenes only exists one of that particular thing whether that's something which could control all your audio or special effects and this can maybe help you do that if you're struggling with that type of thing. Number five is the simple turret system which in this package includes a actual a turret model. It can do auto targeting. It has a shooting system, handles health, bullets, has sound effects and actual audio and particle effects based on the things that you hit. So if you're trying to make a tower defense game, this might be a cool one for you to actually use. Number six is the VR material manager and this allows you to change materials if you've got a, a sort of VR headset and you can change it in VR play mode and it enables you to have the ability to modify and adjust existing designs in virtual reality so if you are somebody who likes to do that it's tested with the HTC Vive and it can help you achieve that type of thing. And number seven is the RPG Box Free, and it's the free version of this. And it's an RPG style toolkit, which will um, help you reduce development times and includes a lot of actual cool functionality, which includes an inventory system, shop system, equipment system, items, attributes for mods and stats, as you can see with the um, sort of images below. It includes loot tables and items, and you can go for the pro system, which will include enemy spawning, floating numbers for when you probably hit enemies, um, loot drops and things like that to create your own enemies and so on. So this free version could you know, really go a long way to helping you create a you know, fully functional small little RPG. And number eight is the Photon Thunder or which helps you run sort of unit, um, unit games which is the networking um, sort of functionality on the Photon um, networking without having to change very much which allows you to use the photon sort of network with all the managing stuff behind that without you having to change much um, in regards to the things that you use there. Number nine is the oculus integration which is um, a system which helps you um, support for rendering audio, um, avatars input and helps you have um, lets you integrate a lot of the Oculus features directly into the game that you've got, whether that's, you know, the Gear VR or the Oculus Rift, for adding a lot of different features, achievements, services, um, to fully uh, into implement into Unity with the actual SDK. And number 10 is the Free Vertex Wind, which is a package which lets you create wind without actually having the elements there. And it's a script which will sort of transform the vertexes which are there to create the illusion of something sort of moved in the wind. And it allows you to have directionally thing and it's fully documented um, for you to use. And remember, all of the free assets that I feature for July 2017 um, are available on my list and I will provide a link in the description. So thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.